An Android launcher gives your phone a complete makeover. It changes how your phone looks and feels. It adds a lot of new features to your phone as well. So in this video, I'm gonna show you top 10 best launchers for your Android device. So the first launcher on the list is Google Now Launcher. If you want to experience stock Android on your phone without installing a custom ROM, Google Now Launcher is the best you can get. It's the exact same launcher found in Nexus device and it has all of the features. Swiping to the right will take you to Google Now, where you can get the information you want like weather updates, you can add your favorite sports team and view its live score, next fixture, you can have news and many more. While in the home screen, you can say OK Google to launch Google Now and start interacting with it by saying your search query to send a message, get direction or play a song, and many more. The notification bar is transparent just like a Nexus device and a Google search bar is always present at the top of the screen. Everything else is pretty similar to a normal launcher. Inside App Drawer, all apps are sorted alphabetically with big icons. This launcher seems pretty fast and responsive. It's much faster than ThoughtSwiz. Overall, it's one of the best launcher. The next launcher on the list is Themer. I have already shown this launcher a couple of times. If you want to customize the look of your phone and make it look very different, then Themer is the launcher you need. This launcher has taken Android theming to next level while making it super easy. This launcher lets you to choose between hundreds of amazing themes that you can have in your phone. To apply one, simply tap the apply button and everything will be done in a moment. Since its release, a lot of users have made a lot of themes and it's still growing. You can even change few elements of the theme if you want to. From the settings, you can set gestures to trigger actions. Change icon packs, choose default applications, and many more. Apps are organized automatically too in the app drawer. There is a favorite section in the app drawer as well. Overall, it's the best tool for Android to change its look. The next launcher on the list is Nokia G Launcher. G Launcher was recently announced by Nokia. This launcher is stylish but very unique. The main home screen has a clock widget and displays six applications contacts or web links. Over time, this launcher learns how you use the phone and depending on what time of the day it is, the apps on the screen will change. But when the application you want is not displayed, you can use its desktop control. Simply draw the letter and all the application and contacts will quickly load up on the screen. You can draw anywhere on the screen. Adding letters is also possible if you have a lot of application. On the bottom, in the dock, you will find stock application with app drawer button. That's everything about this launcher. No widgets, no customization. It's a simple launcher with a really good looking design. The scrolling is super smooth. As for now, this launcher is limited to some devices and, and is not available in the Play Store. The download link is in the description box below if you want to have it. The next launcher on the list is Action Launcher. Action Launcher is a very popular launcher which is praised by many top tech sites. Like other launchers, this one has lots of tools to keep your home organized, managing folders, and checking widgets. On the top, you have a quick search option and a Play Store link. The quick search is a very fast way to search applications, contacts, and music directly. You will find the app menu by swiping to the left from the corner. Widgets can also be found there. Swiping from the right will take you to Quick Pace, which is a fully featured home screen where you can add widgets, applications. This page can be accessed from anywhere, even if you are using any application. For any folder, you can set a cover application. So when you tap the folder, that application will load up. To access the folder, you need to swipe up the icon. Shutters is a very unique feature that introduces a new way to check widgets of any application. To see the widget, simply swipe up the app icon and it's on the screen. The widget is there on your screen without using any screen space. Other than that, this launcher allows you to hide notification bar. Only swiping down will reveal it. 
It also allows you to change icon packs, change dimensions, change icon scaling. OK Google Voice activation also works in this launcher. Overall, this launcher is a complete package with unique useful features and all of the tools you need to customize and stay organized. The next launcher on the list is Yahoo Aviate Launcher. Aviate Launcher comes with a clean design, intelligent user interface and smart features that will simplify how you use your phone. There are three different screens. On, on the left side, there is an intelligent screen where you will be shown the application and information that you need at that time. Like it shows music application and widget when you plug in earphone, news and weather application in the morning, productivity application at work. It changes through time and your location. The main screen looks clean. There is only one screen where you can add widgets. And on the right side, you will find the app group based on the categories. Swipe further and there is an app menu grouped alphabetically. Other than that, this launcher allows you to set the icon pack. And there are three different themes that you can choose from. Overall, this launcher is very useful with, with its intelligent screen, which helps us to stay organized. The next launcher on the list is Nova Launcher. Nova Launcher is a highly customizable Android launcher. You can change almost anything you want in this launcher. Despite its high customizability, this launcher is very fast. At first look, it looks very similar to a normal launcher. App drawer is at the bottom. There is home screen to add widgets. But when you go to the settings menu, you can see all of the customizing options. From the display option, you can change desktop grid size, home screen number, scrolling effect, scroll indicator, turn on icon labels, enable overlapping widgets, and many more. You can even change app drawers look and feel. You can change its grid size, scrolling effect, its background, make it transparent, hide applications and many more. You can even change icon packs, icon size, font, you can even hide notification bar and many more. There are tons of customizing options here in this, in this launcher. With all of these features you can totally change how your phone looks and feel. The next launcher on the list is Terrain Home. This launcher makes your Android phone simpler by putting everything you need in one place. Terrain is based on a single home screen panel with a link to most used application. Below you will have Terrain Search which is a quick way to find contacts, application and anything you want on the web. At the side there is Terrain Sidebar which is the most talked about feature of this launcher. It's a list of cards like frequent contacts, news, settings, weather and so on. You can edit and add your own cards as well. You can add cards for toggles, any news feed, for any social site. New cards are being added regularly. This sidebar is like a mixture of Google Now and HTC's Blink Feed. And at the right side, you will find the app menu where applications are sorted alphabetically. Widgets can also be found there. That's all about this launcher. The next launcher on the list is Everything Me Launcher. All other Android launchers allow to tweak certain things, but Everything Me Launcher takes a different approach. As you start this launcher, the home screen is already set up for you. In the morning, this launcher will automatically show you the weather and news application on the screen. While you are in the city, you can get the nearest place with around me and smart folder. Over here, you will find the smart folders which are automatically created by this launcher based on the categories of the application. Right. The search option provided here is a very fast way to search application and contacts. So that's all about this launcher. It's a launcher where everything has been set up automatically and provides the right thing for you at the right time. The next launcher on the list is Smart Launcher 2. Smart Launcher 2 is a very simple launcher. It's completely different from any other normal launcher. The home screen has a clock widget with 6 different applications below. Adding a folder and other application is also possible. Swiping to the right will open the app menu where applications are sorted, sorted based on the categories. It also has its own theme store. This launcher also includes some useful extra features like double tap to lock, 
hiding applications from app drawer and opening google now by saying ok google overall this is a very fast launcher as there are very few elements loaded up on the screen that's all about this launcher the last launcher on the list is launcher 8 launcher 8 replicates the windows phone 8 interface it's almost identical from the outside you will have the tile interface as seen in windows phone 8 all the tiles are customizable on the right side you will have the app menu which is very much similar to windows phone 8 there are a lot of themes that you can download from the theme store provided in this launcher some of the themes are really good overall this launcher is very fast and provides decent options for customization you can add tiles of different sizes create your own theme and add widgets in tiles as well so that's all about this launcher okay, if you are bored with the normal look of android and want to have something new just give this launcher a try so that's all on top 10 best launchers for android there are lots of launchers out there in play store if you know of any launcher that you think is very good just comment below so that's all thanks for watching to subscribe for more videos have a nice day